and defeated Hyung to become Diamonds Division champion. And her opponent from Houston, Texas, she is the Diamonds Division champion, the Renaissance woman, Hyung. Brad Gilmore, you have referred to Hyung as the Renaissance woman, and why not? A two-time Reality of Wrestling Diamonds Division champion, the history of Hyung in reality of wrestling and now bringing her to this point here tonight where she will defend that title inside a steel cage. A remarkable career, short as it is, but her star definitely on the rise and she continues to evolve as one of the most brutal grapplers in reality of wrestling. Oh wait, hold on, these two ladies getting face to face here already. This is the first time the Diamonds Championship has been defended inside the confines of a steel cage. It's only the second time in Texas wrestling history that two women have entered the structure. The bell rings. The rules are simple. Oh, wait a minute. In fall submission or escape the cage, there are no disqualifications. There must be a winner. between these two. It has boiled over to this moment, and it's going to explode here tonight in our main event. Ion has been a part of some pretty big moments here in the Diamonds Division, and we've seen her continuously compete in title match wrestling's ladies' night out. But will this moment be a little bit too big for AQA, Brad Gilmore? Wait a minute. Look at that, Angela. Oh. It's a great question, Matt Topolsky. Angela has been to the mountaintop before here in reality wrestling and captured that Diamonds Championship. But the question has been consistency. And one part of it, of course, is because of the injury she sustained courtesy of Hyun. There hasn't been a sustained title defense on her part. And this is about as big a stage as two athletes will find themselves in in the main event inside the steel cage with the gold hanging in the balance. Right, you are. And a great scouting there by Hyun. And again, that cage is unforgiving. That cage has no give to it. No, oh, and look at, hold on. Angela grabbing on to the cage. Well, Angela hanging on like Spider-Woman here. Oh! And comes down throat first across that top rope. And those ropes are tight. There is a metal cable inside of those, and that right there could crush your throat, crush your sternum. A very dangerous situation early on, and you said it, Brad Gilmore. That cage has no give, and you know both of these athletes are going to try and use it here tonight as a weapon. And when they can, it's with well within their rights. It's in the rules. You can use that cage. As we just saw. Of string of victories after another. She continues to put them together. Tonight, if she were to emerge from the steel cage with the Diamonds Division Championship still firmly around her waist, what a statement it would make. Certainly, she has been making the case that this division now belongs to her. And now they're all... 
the apron. And she's oh, and look at this. She's just raking Angela's face across the metal. Oh, my goodness. That's she, hard she, to watch. She's shoving her face into that steel. The chain link fits. Oh. And all our referee can do is just look along. There's nothing illegal about any of those maneuvers. Look out, look out, look out. Oh. And Brad, Hai Young had Angela positioned with that metal post, that support post, right between her and her face. Here we Cover go. here, one, one two. No. Kick out by the challenger. But the damage has been done. The damage continues to be done. Hai Young stalking the challenger now. Suplex hangs on here. High on. Looking for a second. AQA leaps over the top. Oh my goodness! An elbow and a forearm right to the face, and another one, and that's a stunning elbow to the face, and now coming back with a forearm. Yeah. Wait a minute, high on. Got her now up on the shoulders. What's she looking to do? Is she gonna, she gonna throw her face first into the, into the turnbuckle? A little snake eyes there in the corner. High Young now. Oh! Knee to the temple. Crushing her head between her knee and that metal fencing. Cover one, two. Kick out there from the challenger. But Brad, you start to get the sense that perhaps AQA may have come back a little bit too soon or that maybe the moment is just too big for her here tonight. You know what, Matt Topolsky, you might, you might be right. And look, now on that arm, now on that arm. Trying to further damage. Oh, my. The injured arm. Ion trying to turn the challenger into a human pretzel here. She could win by submission. There is absolutely no place for AQA to go oh, right this now. This is it. This is it, Matt Topolsky. We're going to... We're gonna see Hai Young retain her championship here in the center oh of the my ring. Goodness! Hai Young, unforgiving, extremely cerebral Wait and vicious in there. Wait a minute. A pin attempt here, perhaps from AQA, just out of desperation. Only a one count, but AQA able to get herself out of a very bad predicament. But I'm afraid, Matt Topolsky, you might be right. Angela might have come back way too soon here. And now Hai Young going for a power bomb, and Angela in the corner. Angela hanging on here. She climbs over that cage and her feet hit the, hit the floor. She'll be Diamond's champion. Hai Young now joining her up there. And both these women on that top rope. Well, there's a reason why this is called high risk territory because rarely do things end well for either party. Oh my goodness, what a knife edge chop from the champion. AQA firing back and then a shot right there to the ribs. And Ayan is down. AQA is still up there on the top rope. <laughs> oh, but not for long as Ayan comes right back. Oh, Matt, what is she thinking? Oh, no. Top rope. Suplex! Oh. Superplex from the oh. champion! If enough damage hasn't been done, that has got to be the exclamation point. If Hai Young can roll over and get the pin, she will retain the Diamonds title. This is the main event on Reality of Wrestling for the Diamonds Division Championship. Inside a steel cage, Angela AQA versus Hai Young, the Renaissance woman. And what a fight it has been. Referee up to a count of seven. Not exactly sure which women has the advantage here. This would be a shame if this ended in a no contest. The very reason for putting these two inside a steel cage was so that we could get a winner here tonight. That's what Booker T knew the Row Nation wanted.
Oh, wait a minute. And Hyun calling for that door to be open. And she's able to crawl out. She's going to remain the champion. And she has a great shot at it right now, Matt Topolsky. Well, tell you what, Brad. Hyung in survival mode here. She's about to walk out with her championship. Angela, though, AQA grabbing that right leg. Oh! And a big forearm as the door closes. I don't know how Angela is on her feet right oh. now. Superman punch! Superman punch out of nowhere! Slight blade here from the challenger. Somehow, Angela battling back after taking that superplex off the top rope. Slip out the back door, and this main event rolls on. Diamonds tight, just hanging out there for one of these two to capture the moment, and what a moment it would be. But Matt Topolsky, have they given it all they could? How much is left? What more abuse can they put each other through? Oh, wait, hold on now. Uh-oh, uh-oh, we're looking. Oh, look at this, look at this. Sleep. She's looking for that beauty sleep. Number one, two is an inside cradle. able to get out of that beauty sleep once. Oh, oh not this up. time. Face first. High Young is about to retain the Diamonds Championship. Two. Oh, oh my goodness. That is the first time anyone has ever kicked out of the beauty sleep. And High Young cannot believe it. She's hyperventilating in the center of the ring. I think one of the things that bothers the Renaissance woman so much that, that makes her enraged is that she has finally met a challenger that has the same ambition, the same drive, the same fire in her gut that Hai Young has. And that drives her absolutely crazy, Brad. And it was demonstrated right there, kicking out of the beauty sleep. Well, Hai Young is the Renaissance woman. She's going to have to find another way out of it. Oh, wait, here comes Angela with a jumping bulldog. One of the Diamond Championship. Angela, pump handle. A modified pump handle slam hooks the leg to win the Diamonds oh, title. Oh, wow. We're talking about an inch away, literally, from becoming two-time champ. Angela now can't believe it. That maneuver has gotten her W's here in Reality Wrestling before. And now, both these women back to a vertical base as the onslaught continues. I mentioned every physical encounter these two women have had. One of them ends up in a medical facility. Will that trend continue? Well, I think it's absolutely inevitable considering what they've done to each other so far. Head scissors. Angela hangs on. Oh, she gets ejected into the corner by the champion. High on the body avalanche. High on is so impressive, Matt Topolsky. The continuing force that she brings forward always in her matches. Absolutely. I mean, it, it, she's 100% kinetic energy. She just keeps coming. Boom! Oh, look at that! And a big elbow. Oh! Into that stunner from the second rope. Hai Young looking to put it away here. The pinfall will win her. Pinfall will win the match right here. Wait, what is Hai Young thinking? Well, Brad Gilmore, we saw this at Ladies' Night Out. She is the Renaissance woman, and she's added a new technique to her arsenal. She's looking for the 450! She missed it! Oh! High on was going for that 450, and she landed on her face! Angela got the hell out of Dodge! Now can she capitalize? Angela! Oh, big sidekick! Booker T style! Now, wait, hold on. What is Angela thinking? Might be one risk that she does not need to take. This is for the Diamonds Championship. It's the main event. You're damn right. She's gonna take it from the top rope. She's calling for shooting star press. Star press. Shooting star press. Cover one, two, three. Second time!
sure that A2A even can believe it right now. A beautiful, picture-perfect shooting star press. And Angela reclaims the Diamonds Championship.